special edition of Stadium Travel sees the first visit to a championship ground in this feature as Wigan made the trip to the Tetley Stadium home of the Dewsbury Rams for the sixth round of the Challenge Cup. Well, we've arrived in Dewsbury in good time, just past 25 to 2. As Stadium Travels makes another visit to Yorkshire as Wigan visit the Dewsbury Rams in the Challenge Cup round number 6. Concessions, obviously with it being a smaller ground than usual, we've just been in the pub. Obviously the usual critique of the cr critique of the concessions is Justin, he's joined us again today. Don't just know how much have you paid for it? $2.90. What do you reckon? Out of 10? As far as Carlsberg goes, probably one of the better points of having rugby league state grounds. <laughs> A number would be nice. What? A number would be nice. Okay, uh, seven, seven or eight. All right. Seven or eight out of ten. That's not bad for championship ground concession wise. Oh, this is a championship ground. Obviously, the program's a little cheaper, two fifty. Yeah. Ten out of ten for this one. I'll show a bit more of it in the light later on. So we're currently on what I think is a south terrace, as far as the view's concerned. Pretty decent, to be honest, on a sunny day up in Yorkshire. Program, we can see a little better here, obviously. Only a £2.50, but it'll be a good read, so I'd say about 10 out of 10 for that one at the moment. The more news, closer to kick off. So, stadium travels with the Stews, be on an absolutely glorious day up here in Yorkshire. We can come out first, wearing the blue shirt. Even though this isn't a away game, it'll sound pretty much like a home game if you're a Wiganer, because this is absolutely packed to the rafters with Wigan fans this afternoon. Statistics for this game this afternoon, as a personal level, 193rd as the season ticket holder, 182nd for Wigan, 42nd away game, last week I thought it was, but I've corrected the week final since then, second meeting against Jews, be the first meeting back in 2014, it was close for the first half an hour or so, and then Wigan stole to a win. After 125th win myself, under the season ticket bracket, it's a 12th Challenge Cup game I've been to, which in six seasons shows we've not played in a lot. It's the 21st game of 2016. The Jewsbury team coming out now. They'll be playing against the empty end. So that means if Wigan do score first half, they'll be scoring at this end. So it's Jewsbury Rams against Wigan Warriors. It's the Challenge Cup sixth round game. And it's a three o'clock kickoff on this glorious Sunday afternoon. Famous Jewsbury Ram over there. We've moved over to a bit of a cooler side for the second half. It was half time, Jewsbury 4, Wigan 36. Should be a little cooler in the shade here. So, team's coming out for the second half, Jewsbury first. Wigan will be out in a minute probably. Over seven minutes left here. We can currently 54 4 up, so I think placing the next round is pretty much safe. So, full time here at the Tetley Stadium, Jewsbury Rams 4, Wigan Warriors 54. Comfortable in the end. Wigan did take the feet off the gas because it was 36 4 at half time. But well, win's a win into the next round. As far as the stadium's concerned, it's for a championship stadium. Pretty decent, atmosphere 10 out of 10, entertainment on the So, facilities, I'd say about a 7 or 8 out of 10, so this might actually top a few Super League stadiums. I think Wakefield was the lowest so far this year, it might be 41 out of 50, this might just top that, we'll soon see. Even though Dewsbury is a championship club, the facilities of the ground itself ranks it just above Wakefield, which you'd say is a surprise, but considering how old the Wakefield ground is, Dewsbury's done pretty well. It is a very nice place to visit. Visit in 2014 and even this year it was better because I had a bit more time to have a look around. The atmosphere from both sets of fans, even though it was like technically a Wigan home game in terms of attendances, Dewsbury really made themselves heard. The entertainment, uh, a 7 out of 10, you know, like I said, the usual dancers. Obviously, you had Roger the Ram, which was funny. That's featured earlier in this video. But obviously compared to other ones where they've had routines and games and stuff, okay, 7 out of 10. For the programmes, I mean, for £2.50, you're getting what you're getting, pretty much similar to what you're getting at Super League clubs, which is £3, so that's a full, full marks for that one. Facilities, obviously, based on what I've seen and what Justin, who does the concessions bit, has seen, 
The facilities were 8 out of 10, better than Wakefield's, really top notch, usually really ones. And the concessions, obviously, I think it was bad, £2.90 a pound. They're like a little mini bar and a burger van. That's not too bad, about 8 out of 10, like I say, for the size of the ground. So, 42 out of 50 is pretty good. I only expected 40 or lower for Dewsby, but I'm actually quite proud of what they've done there. Should be very proud of themselves, and maybe in a few years it could be a Super League grand, you never know.